Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we are looking at the Dire Straits Studio Albums, 1978 to 1991. So this is the front of the box, and it has like this blue side, and then you get this preview of the albums right there, and then here is the other side. So starting off, we do have the Dire Strait first album, and then here is what the disc looks like. And then the cool thing about this box set is they all come with like these, I'm pretty sure these are what the vinyls originally would have came with, like these little inserts. So this one has like a poster and each one just has, I'm pretty sure whatever the album came with originally. Here is the next uh, Dire Straits album. Now all of the discs pretty much do look the same. They're all like this the black with the name of the album. But this one has a slightly different poster, as you can see. The other side of the poster is just white with, like, lyrics. So this is just, like, the full one. I can't really pull it all out. Then we have the album Love Over Gold with this, like, really cool cover. I think this is, like, their best artwork for an album. This one doesn't actually have a poster. Just, like, a, like a thank you and, like, the different, like, lyrics and stuff. Next one, Dire Straits, Making Movies. And again, the disc is just a uh, plaque. And the insert is just like a lyric sheet with like these tiny little pictures on it. Nothing too special. They stopped doing the posters after like the first two albums. Then we got Dire Straits, Brothers in Arms. Now this one actually does have a different disc, which looks a lot nicer than the black one. But the inside is just a lyric sheet with like these uh, stamps all over it. So then you have Dire Street, uh, then you have Dire Straits on every street. This is the final one in the album. They went back to the black. I don't know why they had the one colored disc and the rest black. I really don't understand that. And then this is just another lyric sheet with like tiny clouds on it. It's nothing too great right there. So that is all that is included in the Dire Straits studio albums, 1978 to 1991. I believe that is all of the albums that they did. I'm not familiar of any other albums besides for these from 1978 to 91, although I could be wrong. Usually these box sets do come with like little booklets with like extra information or pictures or whatever, but this one did not come with anything like that, unfortunately. But it did come with those inserts, which most box sets don't necessarily always come with inserts that the albums came with. Overall, it is a pretty good box set. I do wish they did some more design elements like the CDs or added some extra stuff, even as a booklet or something. But this was like $30-ish on Amazon, so it's not too bad for like six albums or anything. But yeah, this is the Dire Straits Studio Album box set.